hello 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 everyone good morning it's brenda douglas um and uh, i am coming to you with your homebound challenge now some of you may be wondering what is a homebound challenge a homebound challenge is the challenge um, that we are uh, taking to be able to purchase a home right so um, I don't care what the market looks like. I don't care what the interest rates are doing. If you want it, you want it. If you have the desire to become a homeowner, it is possible, right? And so uh, we are taking these challenges so that we can become homeowners, not because we are so good, not because we do everything perfect, but because God is good, right? And he is able, right? So it's not us doing it, it's God doing it through us, right? So your homebound challenge for this episode is for you to purchase items using cash only. Cash only, no debit card, no uh, credit cards, cash only, right? Now, some of you may say, well, I don't understand this challenge, but let me just say, it is, it is, easier for you to swipe a card than it is for you to see cash leave in your hand right right i i like to think of it in terms of one swipe can wipe away a thousands of dollars right i remember when i purchased my car uh and so he needed the down payment and um he was like all you have to do is swipe your card and so I swiped and thousands went away, right, from my account. So that taught me that one swipe can wipe away thousands of dollars, right? Whereas it hurts me more to see cash leave in my hand, right? So again, your challenge is for you to uh, use your cash and not your credit card, right? So that is your challenge. Have a wonderful day. Listen, guys, in these challenges, you want to continue to do these because what happens is the, the behavior becomes a habit, right? And that's what we want, right? We want the behavior become a habit because it's not enough to just buy the home, right? You have to develop the habits that will help you to maintain the home. Right? It's about more than the house, right? It's about more than just buying a house, right? You have to develop the behaviors. So you're not just buying a house, you're buying a community. There's a bigger picture to this whole thing, right? So we want to develop the habits so that we can maintain and keep this house. So many people work so hard to get the house, you know, they go through all these home buying programs and they develop better or they get better behavior. They do better better behaviors but then they lose the house right you want to make your behaviors become a habit so that you can not only keep the house but you can sustain right and you can keep the house from um, foreclosure and also you can make any repairs if necessary why because you have the money management skills right so these challenges again are not only money management skills but also credit skills and then also mindset right so um, anyway, guys, so that is your challenge for this episode. We are going to purchase items with cash and not with um, and not with a credit, uh, not with any credit card. Now, let me just say something else. One more thing about this purchasing with cash. I hate to look at my bank statement. I know we're going to do debit, but I hate to look at, I mean, I know we're going to do cash, but I hate to look at my bank statement and not know where the items went, not know where the money went. So that's actually, I'm going to leave that for tracking to, I'm going to leave tracking your funds. I'm going to leave that for another challenge right now. Like, well, you should always track your funds. But my point is that for this particular challenge, you are going to, um, again, purchase items with cash only and not a credit card, any, not a credit card, not a debit card. All right, guys, have an amazing day. And I will talk to you. See you in the next challenge.